In our organization, we follow the principles of least privilege, where we use Okta Lifecycle Management to automatically provision applications and groups based on user attributes to provide birthright access. This makes the life of our IT team much easier and the new employee is productive on day one, since they know that as soon as a new employee starts, they will be granted the correct access to perform their role. However, we don't over-provision access for the sake of convenience. In case a user needs access to some application, they can always use Okta's self-service access request to request access to that resource. With Okta, it's as simple as talking to a colleague. Employees are able to request access to applications right from the collaboration tools they already know and love, like Slack. Let's see how this works. Here we see Sally. She joined a few months ago and had all the access to the applications she needed from day one. Because some of the ideas she shared with the product team, they requested her help with a new project. They're using Miro to sketch some ideas. Since she doesn't have access to the application right now, she's going to request it. Okta's access request is great. She can use Slack to create a new request, select Miro, and provide justification. Done. Now because this is urgent, she'll reply to the request right in Slack and tell her to prove her that she needs this as soon as possible. As a team lead, I shouldn't be a blocker to my team. With Okta, approving requests couldn't be easier. I just received a new approval request from Sally. It seems that access to Miro is required to help the product team. No worries there. I'll just review this, click approve right here in Slack without logging into any ticketing system, and done. Can't believe we weren't using this before. As the IT team, we're responsible for approving all requests. We are always the last approvers in the flow. As Octum notifies the entire team, all requests are approved quickly, which greatly reduces the attrition we had with employees constantly asking us to check when their requests would be approved. A new request just came in. Let me jump on it. I can approve this from Slack, but I can also approve it from the UI. I can see all the messages that were exchanged so far, who were the approvers for the requests. Well, everything seems to be good, so I'll go ahead and approve this request. Done. The application was provisioned and the user will be notified. Requesters can use the collaboration tool they're most familiar with, like Slack or Microsoft Teams, to create a new access request to the resource they need. Approvers are quickly notified and can choose to approve or deny the request from Slack, Teams, or the web UI. Administrators have access to a powerful but simple to use workflow builder, allowing them to quickly build new request flows containing one or several approval steps, with individual conditions to determine when the approval is required what actions should be executed, and even what conditions would trigger an action. With Okta Access Requests, we make the life of end users and administrators easier by meeting the user where the user is, and helping administrators to quickly deploy a powerful access request process. Thanks for watching.